Hey guys, Brad from SimpleGuitar.com here, and thank you for coming back to the Total Beginner Guitar Series of videos. Now, what we're talking about today is how to actually pick your strings. So for brand new people who are just starting out, I've seen so many different ways that people pick strings just by default. And so I'm gonna show you one way that has worked for me and has worked for a lot of my students, and you can give that a shot, and I hope it helps you out. So I'm gonna zoom in so that you can see how I'm picking strings and then we'll go from there. Okay, so with you zoomed in here, you can see a little bit better about how I'm gonna be picking the strings and how I'm holding the pick, okay? So just a quick review, I'm setting the pick down, I'm holding my finger like this, setting my pick down on the side of my finger, and then I'm putting my thumb over the top, okay? And you don't want your thumb to hang over very much, if at all, okay? but you also wanna make sure that your picking is not coming from your fingers, that you're not doing this, that it's coming from your wrist, okay? So when you pick a string, what a lot of people will do when they start out is they will lay their pick flat against the string, okay? And that will look like this, okay? And that, I mean, it'll work, but a more efficient way to do it is actually to angle your pick just a little bit, okay? So when I angle it this way, I'm using the outside edge of my pick closest to the tip of my thumb. And when I stroke down on the string, it's just that edge of the pick that hits the string. And so that makes it a little bit easier. And it takes less effort to be able to do that. And then when I pick up, the other side of the pick, the inside edge of the pick is hitting the string. And so I can alternate, I can pick down and I can pick up. And you'll notice all the motion is just coming from my wrist here. Okay, but that makes it easier so that when you are picking, you don't have to fight against your string by using too much pick. The mistake that I see a lot of beginners make is they hold their pick way back here, okay? And they do this kind of thing. And what happens is when you do that, the pick will move. See how the pick moves before I even go to the string? It's like that thing on the price is right when they spin the wheel. You know, like there's a bunch of give in your pick and you don't want that. You want to be able to control your pick. And so by holding it higher and using the edges of your pick, you're gonna get a better sound and it's gonna be less effort for you, which means it's easier, which is good. Okay guys, that is it for how you pick a string. And once again, this is just for total beginners. If you have zero experience with guitar, I hope that this helps you out and, and kind of demystifies it a little bit. It's not hard, but it always helps to have these really simple basic questions answered. So I hope that helps you out. Now, if you haven't already, make sure that you go to simpleguitar.com slash top 10, and there you can download the free guide, the top 10 things to learn on guitar first. And that makes going from being a beginner guitar player to a confident player that can impress everybody when you play guitar a whole lot simpler. So go download that guide for free and I will see you in the next video.